here we are on day three. Starting here in Staffai, heading up to Killam, going over an old railway track route. And I'm here with uh, this little cow here called uh, Arfi. And uh, yeah, looking forward to getting started. 21k today, so much smaller day than yesterday. Okay, so just going on some foresty track here, up to this side, and uh, yeah, just over there, you can see some snow-capped mountains pointing out, which is, uh, I think it's Ben Moore and Stolf Beenen over there, which are ones I've done before and now are very, very steep, so glad not to be doing them today, just uh, some forestry puff. Here we have the uh, Moore 84, which I think is uh, the last bit before we head on to the different uh, rail track bit. But yeah, it used to, be, used to be called King's House. Looks a nice little place to, uh, well, eat, drink, and sleep. Okay, here we are at uh, King's House, which it says here was an important military stop on the way to Fort William to uh, when they needed to uh, deal with some Highland Clan uprising. But you know, there's a map here, so you can see Strathfire, where we started out, and, well, you are here. We're going to go up here to see Loch Earn, which I'm looking forward to, and then furthermore to Killen. There's a fair bit here about Rob Roy. It says uh, blueberries come from here as well, and uh, a few different deers and pine marten. So, off we go. So, uh, walking along this uh, must-be-very-old, mossy uh, fence here. And look, there is a tree just growing out of the top of the fence. <laughs> okay, and the flatness and oddness of this is probably indicating that this was the uh, original uh, railway that went up to Oban. And uh, we've got a nice bridge there, we're getting high up now. And just in the distance, I think we can see the edge of Loch Erm. Okay, and here we are at Loch Earn, so I'm guessing that's Loch Earn head down there. Quite a few little boats there, and uh, yeah, beautiful lock. Time for some uh, lunch. Okay, just around from Loch Earn, and you can see here, this is the Glen Ogle uh, Viaduct. It's a rather pretty on this route here, probably would have carried the train at some point, I suppose. Three kilometers from Killen now, and we get our first look at some of the Munros on Loch Tay. So that is the Tarmacan Bridge. Just outside Killen now, and you can see this is still the railroad path. Uh, even more so, you can see the old railway track bits here, which are sitting next to the road. I guess they're not needed anymore. So, got closer to the Falls of Docket here. You can see the bridge over here, which goes across as well, which is very nice. Uh, this is the historical home of Clan McNab, who used to scream the word Dreadnought as we went into battle. And check it out, there's even a nice little pub just next to it, so you can have a drink there and enjoy the view. Yes, sir. 